and welcome to Daiki Travel. We are here today to do another unboxing. Over the last uh, couple of weeks I've received items which have come directly to uh, Daiki Travel. I'm very grateful for what everybody has sent. Uh, these come from subscribers, viewers, even some uh, businesses have contacted me and said they want to send me something. Uh, I don't mind uh, receiving gifts. I don't think anybody would. So today we're going to be going through a few of the items which have uh, been received. Uh, we've got a few uh, boxes here today to have a look through. I am very appreciative of everything I, I get sent. Uh, if you do want to send me something, uh, by all means contact me. My contact details are below in the description. Uh, I will try and unbox it in one of these videos uh, or I will contact you. If you do send me something and you want a shout out, please uh, put a note in or send me a, an email or text. As I say, all my details will be uh, below. As I say, I'm very, very appreciative of everything I've received. So without further ado, let's go ahead and open up the first one. nothing else in the box to say who it's from uh, it's a little small mp3 player very nice uh, I don't know who sent it to me but thank you very much it's very appreciative I've actually started going back to the gym so this will come in very handy uh, on this because I don't like to carry my phone around when I'm at the gym I've got my sports watch to keep my a track of everything so having this will come in handy Thank you to whomever sent it. Thank you very much. This one I do know who it's from because I had to go and sign for it. Uh, it's from a company uh, who watched my uh, cooking video. I'll put a link below to that. And they contacted me with regards to the mess I made on my shirt. To say. And they contacted me to say, would I like an apron? So the company is called Lavender. Uh, it's spelled L-A-N-T-H-O-U-R. I'll put a link in the description below. Uh, so let's, let's open this one up. There's no noting it, uh, but as I say, they did contact me to say, would I like one? And who's going to say no to... Okay then. These will clip onto the top and then this ties around the back. I'm actually going to be recording a new uh, cooking video uh, over the next uh, couple of weeks. I've been contacted by a few people who wish to cook with me. So this will come in very handy and I will do a demonstration at the end. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, let's open up another one. This one contains batteries. Uh, most of them have come via Amazon uh, because people ask me what can they send me, what can help me get, help me with my uh, channel. So I have created a wish list which I, I put down there. But as I say, this company uh, contacted me with regards to what they could send me, which I feel I think was very helpful. So yeah, Amazon have been coming quite often at the moment. this again has no information of who it's from no return address okay what does it say on that a selfie light ring open it up Okay, 
Okay, it's a bit woof lightning. Yeah, uh, uh, 10 inch lightning. So that was coming very handy. Uh, I know in one of my previous videos I was. I demonstrated some lights that had been previously sent to me and I'm actually using them today. And actually you probably find the sound is a lot better today because I was also uh, gifted a microphone which I'll put a link to that in as well at the bottom. So everything I, I receive I will put a link in if it's available on Amazon as all of this has come from Amazon. So yeah that will be very good for shooting on, on the move. It's very lightweight, comes with an, a phone adapter tripod and a remote so yes that will be very helpful thank you to whoever sent that as i say if you do send anything and you do want to shout out i want to thank you all personally so please try and leave a note or as i said email me to say that you have sent me something uh, okay again doesn't say there's no return address on this one. Just try not to put whatever is inside of it. Then no note inside. It says on the side a Wi-Fi LED bulb. We do have the Alexa here, uh, a few people have spotted that. Okay, yeah, so, yeah, Wi-Fi, Alexa, oh, colour changing, light bulb. Smart light bulb. Okay, so, thank you, whoever, whoever sent me that. I Another one. Oh, so this is actually from Amazon themselves. Uh, saying good luck with with my channel. So let's see what is inside of this. Ah, it's a microphone extension lead. And this... Oh, this is an adapter uh, for my microphone to go into my GX8 Panasonic. Because at the moment I use a my sports cam. Uh, my GX8 I want to start using for at home. I've set it up here actually because I got that new uh, microphone. So this is an adapter for it to, so I can uh, plug it in properly. At the moment, I'm using something I made myself, but this proper adapter will help, help it be secure. And this means I can have the microphone a bit closer, uh, which will, will help. Thank you to Amazon for that. Greatly received. Uh, this one. And it's got a little note in it. A gift for your next adventure. Here's a token of thanks for helping millions of people explore the world on Google Maps. Show off your local guides pride everywhere you go. Local guides. So, ah, this is when on Google Maps you post photos or, or give reviews. Uh, when you do, after so many, you get points and they will send you a gift. Let's have a look. They seem to be a pair of travelling socks. I do like my socks and I like my colourful socks. So thank you to Google Maps. Nice. The next one is a big one. This has been here for over a week and it's quite intriguing to what it is. There's nothing to say what it is. It's very heavy, 
but uh, something off my wish list disappeared, so I think it may be that, but let's have a go at opening it. It does come with a note. It says, keep up the good work on your channel. Hope this helps with the cooking. Regards, number one fan. And it does say a gift note from. So since they put number one fan, I don't think they want their name mentioned. So, but yes, thank you, my number one fan. Uh, thank you very much. Let's So I do do some cooking videos. I've done one so far. I've got one in the pipeline and I've got quite a few people who have said they will cook with me, show me some of the foods and uh, traditions from their country. I've got a Polish one coming up soon. I've got a Czech one and hopefully I've got a, also an Irish one, uh, which I am in discussions with and also uh, some bread making and things like that. So. But I enjoy my Indian cooking and as you can see a nice it's an Amazon basic from my number one fan cast iron. I like cooking in cast iron because you actually the iron uh, seeps into the food so the food is even better for you. So look forward to giving this a go. I do have a couple of more items uh, but I think I will save that for my next uh, video as i say i am very grateful for everything that gets sent to me and if you do want to send something to me by all means contact me and i will give you my uh, address to send it to or you can uh, go on the link and if you don't know what to get me but you want to get me something and um, my wish list is there uh, i'm i will be grateful for anything i receive and i will keep hold of it so again Thank you very much uh, to everybody who has sent me uh, something. I really look forward to using everything I've got here. Uh, the light, uh, as I say, the MP3 player will come in handy. Uh, the apron will save my shirt. My, I had to wash my shirt a few times to try and get the stains out. Uh, as you see, uh, it's a different shirt this time. Uh, as I say, I'm slowly setting up the studio here. I've got the light, which as you see from my previous video, we had fun shooting uh, the headshots for my logo, which is being worked on as we speak. I've got my action cam uh, set up here, uh, which is the Sony. I've got my uh, Panasonic GX8, which is a fantastic uh, photograph camera. It's the first time I'm using it for video. I've never actually thought of using a GX8 for video before, uh, but looking at some reviews and that like, it's supposed to be really good. So I'm giving that another go today. So I can compare the two. I have I think I will probably start sticking with the GX8 uh, at home because I can actually see what I look like and if it's in focus and what the lighting's like. Now I've got the uh, microphone as well. Hopefully the sound will be better and more consistent. I'm, I am learning as I'm going along. Uh, I'm teaching myself the Adobe uh, Premiere Pro, uh, which is good. If anybody is getting into it, uh, I recommend going to download the free uh, sample and having a go with it. Also, the feedback I'm getting from you guys, uh, not many people are commenting below. They are sending me private messages. I'm happy with that. I've, I've got my links in there if you want to ask me anything. I have been asked about 14, 15 questions so far. So I am going to do a question and answer uh, a video. So if you do have any questions, please, over the next uh, few days, send them to me. And I'm hopefully going to be recording that soon. My, my next video I'm doing is going to be uh, one of the questions I've been asked quite a few times is, what did I take? on my solo trip around India. 
So there will be a complete video on what I took with me, uh, what I should have took and what I actually shouldn't have, have taken with me. Uh, as I say, it was a solo trip. Uh, it was for, for four weeks. So there are some things, that, uh, some learnings that I took from that. And as a solo traveller, what was it like? So there will be uh, how, how I travelled around India solo and what, what my takings from that. But please, carry on, like, subscribe, thumbs up. And if you've got any questions or anything, please use the contact details below. And hopefully, I'll see you all soon. Thank you.